everyone, Mike Sherry here with Paul Sherry Used Cars. We recognize that transparency leads to trust, so we do video walk around reviews on all of our pre-owned vehicles so we can kind of be our eyes ears test drive dummy per se on uh, the vehicles that we do sell for you so those of you who are shopping online make sure hopefully makes your shopping experience a little bit more enjoyable maybe saves you some time so uh, in front of me today is a 2021 gmc acadia that i'm out test driving uh, there's not a lot of negatives on this being so new. It does have around 51,000 miles. Uh, brakes felt good. Tires look good. It's got the V6 in it. I believe nine speed automatic transmission. This is a third row, so you can fit uh, six passengers in this. This has the bucket seats, which I know a lot of you prefer. Uh, I like the trim on this, so it's an SLT, and it's got the appearance package, which in General Motors world, they call it the elevation uh, trim. Uh, so what that does is it gives you your black effects, a little bit of black on the wheels, black decals, and black front grille up here. So it's a nice appearance package. Looks good on this red. They call this red Cayenne. Uh, looks looks really good. Uh, so yeah, let's go ahead and start the review. On uh, checking, I like to check the front windshield for cracks and things. I don't see any. It looks good up there. Again, you got your blacked out front and lower grille. Does have parking sensors in the front bumper too. I don't see any major damage up here. A couple smashed bugs that I must have hit, but other than that, looks good. Uh, I got your LED headlights in there, fog lights down low. Again, parking sensors in there. Uh, does have. Uh, Alloy wheels here, uh, and then these tires were just put on last year. They got a date 19, 2021. And notice the black uh, paint effects on the wheels, part of that elevation package. A lot of trim left. These tires are Michelin tires, so not a cheap tire that they put on, so that's always good. Uh, backs of the mirrors are painted black, and then you're gonna have your Acadia. Notice there's no R in there. A lot of people throw R in there. I wonder where that is, Acadia. Uh, painted handles here looks good. SLT is painted in black, looks good. And then like I mentioned, it's got your bucket seat, so you can do two in the first row, two in the second row, two in the third row, two times three is six. Got your uh, WeatherTech matting down here. I don't believe it's WeatherTech brand. I think it's actually General Motors brand, So, but it fits really good. I like that. I got armrest here, looks good. Got your heat and air conditioning controls back here for the pastures, looks good. Uh, got a, a power outlet there, it's pretty cool. USB outlets, pull out beverage and kind of collect all tray. Uh, AC and heat ducts through the ceiling here. Got some map lights or reading lights back here as well. Nice uh, trim here, looks good. Next here on this, I really didn't see anything wrong with it. I mean, a few little scratches here and there. I mean, those on the bumper, just when they bring them in and out, it's almost probably rub out. I think I actually did that with my fingernail. So yeah, probably rub out when they detail it. Wiper, defrosting rear window, got the backup camera on it. This does have a uh, power tailgate and I didn't bring the remote with me. And then I will show you one thing I like, but I don't like, depending on how you're gonna use it. Uh, so I did actually bring the remote with me. Let me show you this why I got it. Uh, it's got unlock and lock, and then you've got remote start, and then you have a uh, tailgate release, power tailgate and panic. This has got dual exhaust down there as well. Uh, so these, these I like if you plan on keeping this third row down, which I know a lot of people do, uh, but I don't like if you gotta keep the third row up because they really, there's just nowhere for them to go. And maybe I'm dumb and not doing it right. I kept trying, I'm like, this just doesn't work for me. So, but I do wanna show you a couple things. These fold down that third row, and then that's gonna flip over. So that's a nice platform. Uh, it's kind of that WeatherTech matting material. It's actually General Motors, uh, but just a nice area for storage. And then check this out. I don't think I've ever seen a vehicle with this. I was like, what are these for? Well, look here, I'm gonna pull on this one and that left seat's gonna go down. And then if I'd pull on that one, the right seat would go down pretty slick you know if you got a big box you don't want to go around I like it now notice back here you got a USB on this side beverage holder on both sides uh, and then to lower it you can use your keyless entry or push the button right up there pretty slick now there is parking scissors in the rear bumper we saw them up in the front bumper so you got parking scissors front and rear this is I don't think I mentioned it all-wheel drive and then again Acadia 
Now financing is available on this. Another way we're transparent with our customers, you can actually fill out all your information from wherever you're at right now on the device you're watching this video on. So if you're interested in financing, want to save some time and hassle in the dealership, 90% uh, of our customers do it. Just check it out, it's really cool. Um, right here we've got uh, a blind spot monitoring in the mirror. Another cool thing about that financing, if you've got your own bank, you can see what we can do and then maybe go to your own bank see what they can do if they're better so just get you more educated and come with more information as you go to buy a vehicle which is always good uh you got your general motors yeah definitely gmc uh form-fitting mats those are cool all right as we come in i already got it running I have the air on sorry be a little selfish but i was like i want to keep the air on got 50,575 miles on it no issues starting or anything like that uh, no warning lights on the dash um Let's just look at the options starting on the door here. It's got power locks. Mirrors are all power as well. And then power windows. Got the one touch windows up front here. Electronic parking brake. And then this, you can actually open and close that rear lift gate with that. Uh, leather steering wheel has a Ford collision. Uh, and then you've got uh, cruise control. And then this will control the center digital cluster. It shows your miles per gallon, miles per hour, things like that. Hands free connectivity. And then there are some radio buttons back here for volume and uh, changing the channel. Uh, over here is the radio, I think they call this 8 inch, 8 inch radio. I'm going to put it on reverse, we'll check out the backup camera, pretty cool, shouldn't hit anything, if you do you're going to see it in the camera, if you're paying attention you got, uh, let's see the sources here, these radios always trip me up, hey I found it first time, AM, FM, Sirius XM and Bluetooth, maybe they made it easier in 2021. Uh, let's see here. It says navigation. Looks like it's got it. That's good. Apple CarPlay, Android Auto. You can uh, set your users. It's just general motor climate stuff. Uh, yeah, we hit all the important things there. Heat and air conditioning controls are uh, automatic system and they're two zones. Oh, and you can sync them together. Uh, this is actually how you put it in drive. This is your shifter right here. Pretty cool. A spot for your phone, then plenty of spots to charge it. Automatic start stop on and off traction parking uh, hazard little beverage holders. Uh, That's how you put it into four wheel drive, and then you also got like race mode and off road mode, and then you got lane assist right there. Heated seats up here as well. So it's all there. I don't think I mentioned this, but it is a one owner. Uh, just trading in. I think I bought a new car if I remember right. Uh, no accidents, uh, scores really good. Another way we're transparent, we post these on our website, so you can dig into that. There's five pages on that one, so definitely check it out. If you have any questions, feel free to contact us. We'll be happy to help you. This is really nice. I like the bucket seats. I love the color, that red on black. Uh, it just looks classy. And uh, yeah, if you have any questions, let one of our people know. Definitely call before you come. I know these are hard to get, and I don't want you driving all the way here just to find out it's sold. So call before you come. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye.